So I'm excited today. Today we're in a new place and we're throwing out Taco Bell again. Taco Bell bag. And we're throwing chicken, steak, cinnamon twist, potatoes, everything. Like everything, a little bit of everything. And we're in a big lake where we've never been before, where people go, as you can see, fishing and stuff. I'm waiting for them to get out so they don't see me with the trap. Well, they already see me with the trap. They're already looking. They're looking. But yeah, so I don't have to stay around here for a while. Look how people leave their tables and people just dump everything. But whatever, so. I'm gonna wait for these people to leave. And. Yeah, so this is the place. So I throw my jet ski here. I plan to do a jet ski fishing video. And see if it works. I don't know if the jet ski will scare the fish too much. But um, you guys see the, the pipeline over there? You could get on from the grass there. I don't even know why they build a little barrier so you can get on. You can get on perfectly there. I plan to walk like around the middle of the lake, throw it, and then tie it. But I don't know how I'm gonna tie it. I'm gonna see if I don't throw it too far and I can tie it too short. Cause I was thinking I'm just gonna tie it, but one people are gonna see it. And they're gonna see a big just a big uh, like rope there. People are gonna investigate it and. For safety reasons, I don't want nobody to pass in like their bow or jet ski and then, I don't know, you know, an injury or something. So I'm waiting for these people to leave. Trying to see if they caught anything, see what type of fish they caught. But I don't know, because they don't have fishing rods now, I think. Unless the fishing rods are like on the floorboard of the boat. I don't see none. So, yeah, I'm gonna wait for these people to get out. Nice current, low tide, no nice effect. I wanna investigate something. When I drop this off, I wanna go to the other side of this canal slash lake. It goes out to a big lake. This is by the Dolphin Stadium. Yeah, it's gonna take forever, bro. When I do, I get the boat, but when I just get I'm in and out. In and out. But yeah, I be scared with the the Challenger and the jet ski here. You have to like even with their little boat and a bigger car, somebody has to stay on the jet ski or on the boat with the motor on and accelerate with the car so you can get on. If not, you'll fall back. So every time I throw here, it's scary and I can't throw by myself because how can I drive out with somebody in the jet ski? So that's gonna be the mission for my jet ski video that I'm planning to do. So yeah. The size of the iguanas are here because you see a lot of homeless people stay on the bridges and stuff. And live around here. I don't wanna bother nobody. But I'm stealing the stuff here. Awesome. Nope. I think so yeah, I can really say from looking up here at the rocks that there's so much nothing. <laughs> so yeah, let's look at the cage. I told you guys 
Yeah, that's why I had to get here, sorry. Got me on top of the bridge. Some strong current here, man. It's like, it's like the ocean. So yeah, I don't want to drop my camera. But as you can see, the line, I tied it over there. So that metal right thing over there. And you probably can't see, but right down there I threw it. Couldn't throw them out because the line didn't reach. I didn't want to leave it down in the middle to be more visible. You know, I don't want nobody to steal it or anybody to get injured because with a rope there, <coughs> with a rope there, you never know. Somebody going fast in a boat and the just not looking, ah, right, right into it, and then you know, fall off their jet ski, fall off their boat, crash it, whatever. But yeah. This thing goes for miles and miles to a, I don't know if you can see it all, all the way over there, it's a bridge. And then that goes on to a big, huge loop that I plan to keep on going, see what I get here. If not, I'm gonna go a little bit more. And then I'm gonna go to that bridge. And then now I'm gonna go to that lake. And then it keeps on going that way, which is by the Dolphin Stadium. And it goes all around to Hollywood. All the way to Hollywood, so I plan to do that. I work by Hollywood, so there's a lot of canals by there. So yeah, we'll be back. We'll be back in a few hours. See what we got. Okay, guys. So I just got here. I was coming back to the spot, and I didn't have time to record. I got here, and I just see running across the field a baby duck by himself. Like, look. By himself, and he just—I just ran up to him and I grabbed him. So I'm gonna take out the the. I'm sorry, I just everything happened so fast. I'm gonna get the cage, and then I'm gonna stick around a little bit, see if I see his mom around here or not. I'm gonna save him because he's gonna—he's gonna die out here. So we'll see what we do. So we're we'll back here, and yeah, we're gonna put it out. See what we got. Come on, you see those fruit, pineapples, apples? That's a witchcraft. So yeah, honestly, you see people in the jerseys. I don't see the. What do you want to look at those? You want to... Those are not. I don't see nothing. But look at that current. I'm kind of happy about that current just because I guess the smell could. Uh, I guess the smell can um, go longer because, you know, go further. And the other pond is dead, so. So I'm really sad guys, nothing at all, like not even a little baby fish, not even something I didn't even want, you know, we didn't stay over, you know, it's one of these things that nobody can want, but yeah, it was talking about three, four hours, so, but yeah, man, I don't know, that carrying is just so strong, I just feel like the fish wouldn't even be around there, I guess. But it was more you can see right now. It was in the middle of the middle. But, hey, we saved the baby duck. I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna raise it. And I'm just gonna keep him. I'm gonna do a little enclosure for him. I just. not even a duck around here, you don't know mother ducks, no other baby ducks. He was just, I was parking, he was just there. What is he doing here? So yeah, I'm gonna save his life. So, I'm just bummed out. We didn't get nothing. 
but okay. See you back at home. Bye, kid. We're Lucy. Jesse. And yeah, I don't know. I'm setting up the cages. I'm trying to see. I like this cage, but I don't know, man. I have to put this right here for the baby duckling. So yeah, let me see which one I have to be. That one's newer, but I think those holes are bigger. I want to make sure that she doesn't escape or anything, because I don't. I took her, you know, that lake is like a mile or two from my house. So if she escapes from my house, then she's really going to die because her parents are already gone. And here there's the the street and our watch that. But she kills everything just for fun, bro. I swear to God. So, yeah. So we're back here, setting up just for tonight, or for the next night, I don't know, for a couple of days. Worst comes to worst. There's a little spot. You can see I cut a little hole on the screen. So you can have proper ventilation. And yeah, these lights, they get really warm. I put it to the shivering, he was in the water swimming. So I'm gonna I left the lights on. Yeah, they get really warm. I mean I'm scared that the bin will melt or something. So yeah, comment below, what should we name him? Like and subscribe, share, Steven out. Oh.